Hi, welcome back to the garage. Well, it's been almost a week since going to the vintage bash down in Knox, Melbourne. And I've got the three buggies here on the bench that I took with me. The Super Shot, Blockhead Motors, Wild One, and the Buggy Champ. In various states of repair, disrepair, whatever. Had a brilliant time, never ran a buggy or a radio control car on a track. Apologies to any of those that I got in the way. I did try to keep out of people's way and uh, not ruin anybody's race. Again, had an awesome time. Thanks to everybody that was there. The, the organizers, Louis Sola, hospitality was awesome. Uh, met some great guys, guys from Melbourne, guys from Adelaide, just all over the world came to the event. It was just so good. So here's the wild one. This went all the way there and had a few practice laps on Thursday before the designer, Jun Watanabe, who was also there racing all weekend, signed it for me. And I was kind of reluctant to then drive it after that. Here's the current state of the buggy champ. I ran this in the Jurassic demo and also in place of the wild one in the two wheel drive category so it got a really good hammering um, i think it spent more time upside down than on its wheels i've stripped it right down cleaned everything um, ready to put it all back together so there's no literally no marks on anything um, the only stuff that i'm going to replace is the body set because i want to do the paint again and do a better job this one i did first when i first got back into this during covid and it's okay, but I think I could do it better. And uh, to be honest, it was, I think the body set was about 50 Australian dollars compared to $33 for a sticker set. So I just bought the whole thing. Um, I'm gonna replace the bumper, which is a bit scuffed, and the wheels. Tires have come up okay, there's not a mark on them. And uh, yeah, that'll go back together and go on the shelf with the other SRVs, which are sort of over here waiting. Then onto the super shot, which I've just stripped down completely, cleaned everything, put it all back together. This again, got absolutely hammered. Went really well. Um, one of the rear shocks exploded because I hit a big jump and when it landed, it just fell to bits. Uh, bumper came loose. Other than that though, this thing's great really. Um, Bit of wear on the tyres, they're worn out. A few scuffs on the on the wheels. Um, but these antenna, these seem to save it when the thing goes upside down. Like the body's perfect. Um, the only real sort of signs of wear is obviously a bit of battle damage underneath on the skid plate and the bumper. So all in all, not too bad. That looks yeah. awesome. That's amazing. I know. Thank you very much. Get it for me as well. <laughs> Can you drive it for me as well? Show me how it's done. <laughs> I'm not joking. Just stick your tongue out when you do it. Hey. There you go. Now get a, get a picture of him with the car. There you go. Yeah, you can do a video. Yeah, yeah, Thank yeah. you very much. Yeah, no problem. I brought it especially for you to sign for me. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Okay, Glenn Grinter, go. Anthony Howard, go. BJ Louie, go. Jason, go. Piers Morton, go. Yun Wantanabe, go. 
Dean Go. Dean Fisk, go. Christian Ferran, go. Mark Watton, go. Rob Jeremiah, go. Drivers are finished. Second Anthony done.
Cameraman. <laughs> I, could, I could see it teeter and you might have got to it in time. And then I'm chucking in the
to say he's really living this one with the Palestinian Transformers, but they're all out there just having a bit of fun in the dust. You can see a few to me, uh, super shots out there. A couple of optimists as well. This is the car coming through race control now. The, the computer sees us coming back. T1. Now, caution on the tabletop, we've got one on the through, all four, thank you, Marshall. Okay, this is going to cross the leader in his position. I don't know whether he recorded that like he's in the grass, but we can adjust that. We can watch this race and see it's between these two cars going in front of the driver's stand. They're both paying into each other, trying to get the win, having a laugh up there on the stand. seconds to go. Looks like the hot shots got a super shot got a little bit more pace there in the back straight. He's got one lap to really in. Oh, no. oh, it's died, has it? It's died. That's all right, Bill. You've got to just keep going. Right, so here comes the lead car. It feels in second is actually first. So Marlon actually won that one. Um, he crossed the glass here and missed his luck. I saw it happen. So Marlon, I'll add that light back in for you. Congratulations on uh, winning the e -main. First name for the day. Well done.